What is the new keyword in JavaScript? The new keyword in JavaScript can be quite confusing when it is first encountered, as people tend to think that JavaScript is not an object-oriented programming language. What is it? What problems does it solve? When is it appropriate and when not? It does five things. It creates a new object. The type of this object is simply object. It sets this new object's internal, inaccessible, prototype, that is proto property to be the constructor function's external, accessible, prototype object. Every function object automatically has a prototype property. It makes the this variable point to the newly created object. It executes the constructor function, using the newly created object whenever this is mentioned. It returns the newly created object, unless the constructor function returns a non-null object reference. In this case, that object reference is returned instead. Note, constructor function refers to the function after the new keyword, as in. Once this is done, if an undefined property of the new object is requested, the script will check the object's prototype object for the property instead. This is how you can get something similar to traditional class inheritance in JavaScript. The most difficult part about this is point number two. Every object, including functions, has this internal property called prototype. It can only be set at object creation time, either with new, with object create, or based on the literal. Functions default to function prototype, numbers to number prototype, etc. It can only be read with object get prototype of some object. There is no other way to set or read this value. Functions, in addition to the hidden prototype property, also have a property called prototype, and it is this that you can access and modify to provide inherited properties and methods for the objects you make. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to learn JavaScript. We have a number of awesome tutorials in the works.